Hello grade 9 math class. Welcome back to another lecture. We have lesson one of a new unit here. Uh, the unit is titled exponent laws and bed mass and there's actually two parts to this unit. Like there is exponents one and exponents two. So we are going to do a lot of exponents. We are going to start from the beginning. We're going to assume that you do not know anything about exponents and I'm sorry. Uh, it's just necessary so that we're all, again, on the same page as we move through this, as it does get much more complicated. Uh, we're going to first start talking about powers and bases and what they are and how we write them. Uh, so, you can see we've got three questions on the screen to start. We can do those right away. For these questions in this lesson, you are not going to be required to solve these. You're just going to be required to write them as exponents. Um, essentially, when we have something multiplied by itself multiple times, we are going to raise it to that many exponents. We have 100 here multiplied by itself. One, two, three, four times in the first question. And that means that we are going to be able to raise it to the power of four. 100 to the power of four. You can write it like this, where the four is very clearly smaller than the rest and up in a superscript type area. You can also write it like this to make it very clear. And I may do that from time to time uh, when we get more complicated um, parts of this lesson. Um, but essentially, you count the number of times that number is multiplied by itself and you raise it to that power. Um, I'm going to label a couple of things. This is the base, and this is the power up here. Four is the power, and 100 is the base. I'm going to label that for a couple more, but not all of these. You are going to be expected to label them in all of the questions uh, that you do in this lesson. Let's do another one here. We have 55 multiplied by itself one, two, three, four, five, six, seven times. Uh, stop me, haha, if I got that wrong. But if it's multiplied by itself seven times, that is 55 to the power of seven. Again, this being the base and this being the power. The next one is one. All right, number one multiplied by itself one, two, three, four times. That's one to the power of four. And again, this is the base and this is the power. Uh, get used to these terms. Let's scroll down and do a couple more just for good measure. Uh, we have two next. So two, and I'll put that in brackets. We have one, two, three of them. Two to the power of three. This is the base. This is the power. Next one is again one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One to the power of nine. You can get all the way up into double digits if that is required. Uh, but this is the base and this is the power. And our last one here, six. And then one, two, three, four, five, six to the power of five. So these are all equivalent expressions. Uh, if you have any questions about how to write a power or how to uh, go the other way and expand this out, please let me know. But thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time.